find integral sin inverse of 2x by 1 plus x square dx. Have to find the value of integral sin inverse of 2x by 1 plus x square dx. In order to find value of this integral, at first consider a substitution that is x equal to tan theta. Then on differentiating with respect to x, we will get dx by d theta equal to 6 square theta, dx equal to 6 square theta d theta. So we are going to substitute these values for x and sorry, we will check whether the function is in an integrable form or not. Okay. So on substituting x, we will get 2 tan theta divided by 1 plus tan square theta. It is x equal to tan theta. Then 2 tan theta divided by 1 plus tan square theta into dx. dx is 6 square theta d theta. Okay. Next, what we have to find whether the function is in an integrable form or not. Before that, note that sin inverse of 2 tan theta by 1 plus tan square theta can be rewritten as that is 2 tan theta by 1 plus tan square theta equal to sin 2 theta. So, integral of sin inverse of sin 2 theta into 6 square theta d theta. Okay. What is sin inverse of sin 2 theta? That is theta 2 theta. It is sin and sin get cancel each other. Then 2 theta into 6 square theta d theta. Okay. That is we get the function in an integrable form. That is on taking 2 outside, we can apply integration by parts method here. Okay. By taking u as the first function and v c square theta as the second function. So, on applying integration by parts, we will get integral of theta c square theta d theta equal to 2 into theta into integral of c square theta that is tan theta minus this 2 again derivative of theta that is 1 e again integral of c square theta that is tan theta d theta. Next, what is integral of tan theta? That is log mod sec theta plus c. That is, we get 2 theta tan theta minus 2 log mod sec theta plus c. Next, we have to change theta in terms of a. So, x equal to tan theta, then theta equal to tan inverse of x. What about sec theta? Sec square theta equal to 1 plus tan square theta. Then tan theta equal to x. Then sec square theta is 1 plus x square. What about sec theta? That is square root of 1 plus x square. Square root of 1 plus x square can be rewritten as x square plus 1 whole raised to half. Okay. So substituting these values, we will get 2x into tan inverse of x minus of 2 log mod x square plus 1 whole raised to half. Now we know that log mod x raised to a is a log x by utilizing that property 2 and 1 by 2 get cancel each other that is here we will get half of log mod x square plus 1 by using the property of logarithm then 2 and 1 by 2 will cancel each other then we will get the final result as 2x tan inverse of x minus log mod x square plus 1 plus c. 